little garden info moment. I wanted to show you what squash bugs look like. And I have them at all life stages here. Right there you see an adult. And right here you see eggs and you see the babies. So these are horrible bugs. They will kill your plant. Um, I'm going to try and get rid of all of these. But there's eggs literally all over the place. So it's time to, uh, look at that, there's more. It's time to take care of them. Um, squash bugs and squash vine borers are literally one of my most hated creatures in the garden. Um, so you wanna catch them early when you can. Really you wanna get them while there's still eggs, but um, you know, neem oil is a good thing to do. And um, you can also do for caterpillar type things, BT spray, ooh, wasp, and a few other things. But I wanted you to see what they look like. This is a sh super short video, um, but it's best to get rid of those things while you can. What I did with uh, the, oh wait, here we go, yeah. That is what they look like. Mm, I won't focus, there we go, kind of. So what I did with the baby ones is I literally just smashed them all over this and Heath is gonna crush mama. that big mama. The eggs, you can do, I wanna say you can do neem oil for squash bugs. Um, and there's ants on here, so I'm assuming that there's also aphids. Uh, this is really just not a very healthy plant. It was in a container, it didn't get watered enough. Um, but for the eggs, you can pick them off and drop them in a cup of soapy water. I have a cup here. That I'm gonna put soap in um, but for the eggs I'm just gonna pick them off and put them in a cup don't mind my dirty gardening fingers they're stained like this in the summer but well I just ripped that anyway but just pick them off drop them in the cup I've been painting too if you can't tell what they look like as babies I just found another leaf with more on there I'm gonna smash them smash and drag and then see this is I think they've all hatched out of here well some of them I guess I don't know it's crazy okay so I'm back in the RV because it's just really hot um so I double checked and yes neem oil can be used and I do have a video on neem oil on how to make organic neem oil spray if you go back and find that um and the great thing about neem oil is it also helps prevent mildew and fungus on your plants um, and if, if, if any of you have had powdery mildew before, you know that's no fun. So, um, yeah, definitely catch those, uh, nip those squash bugs in the butt as soon as you see them because they will suck the sap out of your plants and your younger plants will most likely die or can die from it. So you don't want to let them keep breeding and making more squash bug babies. So anyways... That's it. Just a short gardening uh, tip thing to today. Tip thing for today. Yeah, guys. All right. Shalom. I'll talk to you later.